Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm going to talk to you about how two uh, American anarchists, they were Italian-born American anarchists named Sacco and Vanzetti. Um, it was Nicolas Sacco and Bartholomew Vanzetti. They were guilty when they uh, participated in a robbery and a murder in a, in a shoe factory. Uh, they killed a guard of the shoe factory as well as, um, as, well as one other employee. But... <laughs> Here's some latest, latest testimony from by Larry Schweikart, and you can also find this in his book, 48 Liberal Lies About American History, that you probably learned in school, okay? Here's the thing with Sacco and Vanzetti. Yes, they were Italian-born immigrants, and yes, disgraceful, anti-Italian prejudice was rampant in American society at that time. But that doesn't change the fact that they were guilty here, and let me explain why. Okay, their own defense attorney later admitted that they did the killings, okay? Nine people saw Psycho and Vanzetti at the scene. And in the 1980s, when anti-Italian prejudice was a lot less, uh, had drastically declined in American society, forensic scientists looked at the evidence and forensic scientists found that uh, Psycho's gun that the gun was the gun was fired by Sacco that the ballistics matched his, matched his gun and he was seen carrying uh, shells and cartridges in his pockets after the crime took place. So forensic scientists looked at it in the 1980s and they confirmed that Sacco and Manzetti were the killers. So I need to take that into consideration. Okay, so um, it, Psycho and Vanzetti were guilty. They were not innocent. This is we need to remember that part about American history, and they were guilty of the murder. And the judge was right to uh, to sentence them to death. So everybody's doing well. Take care. God bless them. Bye bye.